Hey guys, welcome back. This is the 17th lecture of our bootcamp series. In the last two lectures, we discussed about uh, for and while loops respectively. In this video, we will look at uh, the until loop. Uh, so there is not uh, much uh, to talk about the until loops, but uh, uh, it's just the opposite of while loops. So whatever you do with the while loops, you can achieve with the until loop, but in opposite manner. Okay, so until loop is just the opposite of while loop, where whether the where the while loop works only when the condition uh, satisfied or the condition is true. The while loop is work only when the condition is not satisfied or the condition returns false. For example, look at this. Okay, here you can see that when you execute this code, nothing will happen. Okay. Let's try to run on IRB. Okay, nothing will happen. But if you do until here, you will get this code executed. Okay, so it is just the opposite of while loop. And just like while loop, until loop can also false in can also be in infinite loop. For example, here you can see that i has the initial value 1 and we are comparing like uh, i greater than 10 and in the uh, end of the loop, we are incrementing value of i by 1. Suppose if we do it by minus 1. Okay. Now if we execute this, then you can see it will keep printing the hello ruby developers and falls into infinite execution why it's so because the initial value is one and so first it one greater than 10 then it minus one zero greater than 10 then again minus one uh minus one greater than 10 then minus two greater than 10 and every time the condition is false and whenever the condition is false the until loop get executed so uh that's it uh it is just opposite of while loop and works only when the condition is false okay so that's from it and uh, so we have covered the loop part in the next video we will look at some iterators and uh, then we will go through the conditional structures so thanks for watching the video and till then tata goodbye and take care stay safe